What do y'all cows RC Adventures here? Part two on the 6S. Let's get it going. Let's get it going, y'all. It's way too cold outside to do this though, but I have an itch to bash. And I got my pink gloves on. Dirty gloves. But we're gonna see what I do. Winging in. Ha <laughs> I get used to this. No, that tire is done. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Ugh. Yep. The tire. I think the tire. Was, this is an old tire. I think uh, the hex was done anyway. Ah. Ah. <laughs> 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 Anyway, <laughs> oh. Got <laughs> oh, I ain't gonna drag my uh, Hubs like that. Ugh. I gotta go get my wing. Right there. <sighs> I gotta get used to driving this damn thing. So I'm used to uh, driving a Creighton. <sighs> Thing stripped out. Huh. Okay. And I got a screw on my chassis cables. Uh, sure did. Okay. There we go. Okay. Anyway, we'll check this motor. It'll cool down pretty fast. Got anyway, <laughs> Calvin Knievel EXB bumper. Anyway, y'all, uh, <laughs> I got my tires in the mail coming in. So, like I said, this is the first run. This is the first run, you know, I got to get used to uh, my air control with this short wheelbase, but uh, I like it. Um, I think there's a few things I need to do and whatnot. Arms still good. Uh, I didn't crack the arms, so I don't look like it, so that's good. Let me turn this off before I do something.
<laughs> All right, arm's still good. But it's dirty as hell. And I do need a. I need all my bearings. Bearings need to be greased. Standoff still good. Yep. Something broke on here. I'm a shock. It ain't looking too good. I mean, I figured it out. Anyway, um, again, thanks for watching. It's Cal's RC Adventures. Up here, abusing my RCs. But like I said, it's all about fun. So, you know, I break it, I fix it, and keep on going. So, it's just like, it's got to get used to this sort of wheelbase. You know what I'm saying? So, something to get used to, you know. Still got a long way to go. But, uh, yeah. It's kind of hard to, um, wear gloves and hold my controller. So, I couldn't really, uh get a good feel wearing these gloves and try to uh try to ride so that's why i couldn't really do my do a good air control with these gloves on this i wasn't feeling right but um yeah it's getting cold i just got work out this bash thanks for watching part two uh <laughs> no it's the rc abuse you know what I'm saying? But it was all good. Uh, I think I knew this tire was had a bad hex on it anyway. So, but these are the only tires I had. Um, I had these uh, old pole line shock waves on. I did a test bash yesterday in my yard. And this, you know, I was going to bash in the street. And these are not good at all. No traction at all. Um, probably good for like loose dirt, sand. Not sand, but loose dirt. You know what I'm saying? You know, something like that, but yeah and the body pretty much scratched up but you know got that real steel i gotta wash it but um it's still intact though <laughs> for now it's still intact for now so but anyway um gotta go back to the lab do some fixing and um fix this wing but uh uh I was surprised the wing mount still intact because it's a little cold outside. It's about 45. It's dropping right now, so it's probably like 40 degrees. <laughs> so um, probably not gonna be. You probably not gonna see me bash for a while because it's cold, and I, like I said, I don't like bashing my RCs in the cold, y'all. This is not me. It ain't my style, and I got bad nerves. You know what I'm saying? So. Um, I don't like the cold and my nerves is really bad in the cold and I can't stand it. You know, I'm diabetic so my nerves is pretty bad. And you know, so anyway, let's go find this uh wing mount. This uh wing. I got dirt on my glasses. If I can find it, uh that's <sighs> there we go uh, I might put some longer screws in there yeah I might do that put some longer screws in there that fix that. Ooh, my hands cold, y'all. But again, sorry, I repeat myself. You know what I'm saying? Um, again, um, thanks for watching, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate. It. Leave a comment. You know, I like that. You know, I always reply. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, um, again, in the first video, this started as a Creighton, and I decided I was going to buy me another rig, and I'm like, you know what, this is something for me to do, I'm just going to build me outcast. Um, I've been searching online, trying to find somebody who got some, like a roller for a cheap price, you know what I'm saying, whatever, 
you know, even a bit chassis, I put an ad on and they, nobody was selling anything at my price range. So I'm like, you know what? I got most of my components. I just go to Jenny's RC. Jenny's. And um, this order me some parts. You know what I'm saying? So I got the chassis, um, the arms, towers, wing mount with the wing, um, chassis brushes, EXB. Um, they didn't have the complete uh, tower, tower to tower, so I got that from eBay. Um, the arms, Jenny's, EXB, front bumper. Um, my front diff. I uh, ordered a new diff, you know what I'm saying? Complete set for Jenny's. Um, my rear diff is so my Creighton with the hot racing diff case. Um, you know what I'm saying? So, chassis still straight for now. It's probably going to be in, but these chassis is like nine bucks. You know what I'm saying? It's very cheap. So, it bends, I get another one. <laughs> you know. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Most of the parts, you know, the ESCs for my Creighton. Uh, the motor, I just got that a couple days ago. Cause my old motor is crapping out, uh, so I got that for Jenny's. I uh, got the fans on, you know. But anything else is pretty much Jenny's, and, and the shocks are my stock Creighton socks. You know, what I'm saying like I said again, uh, I did this some diff. Um, I mean, um, some shock maintenance. So I got 90 weight shock oil front and rear. So I'm still tuning on that. And believe me, my shocks with the oil was dirty as hell. <laughs> so y'all make sure y'all uh, service y'all shocks you know what I'm saying once a while you know um dip fluids I got 50k in the front I got 30k in the rear and it actually needs service that diff um then um got the EXB center diff um open that up it was no fluid in there empty of course as armor always does so I got clean it out put 200k in there so I got 200k in the center. But anyway, that's it, y'all. All that talking and yapping. Thanks for watching again. Sorry for repeating myself. Cows RC Adventures. Like, subscribe, whatever you like. Holla, your boy. Peace.